As we come on the air tonight, a pair of spills impacting parts of the Southern California coast. Crews are working to contain an oil sheen in the waters off Huntington Beach, while crews here in San Diego are cleaning up a sewage spill in Pacific Beach. Good evening and thanks so much for joining us on this Friday night. I'm Marcella Lee. I'm Jesse Pagan. That sewage spill happened this afternoon near Missouri Street, just a few blocks north of the Crystal Pier. CBS 8's Anna Laurel has been monitoring the spill since it was first reported and has the latest tonight. Most of the surfers have gotten out of the water. Parents are right now shooing their kids away from the shoreline. The sewage spill has stopped, but thousands of gallons are now in the ocean. A perfect day at the beach ruined by a man-made sewage spill. The city says a vandalized sewer manhole near Missouri Street caused the spill. Sewage overflowed into the street, down into the storm drains, out onto the beach and into the water. City authorities tell us 25,000 gallons of sewage float into the ocean. It sucks, but I can't really stay out of the water. It's part of like the life here. When we first got to PB this afternoon, we saw a lot of families playing in the ocean. Surfers headed into the water. A lifeguard started driving along the shoreline, telling people about the spill, warning of the dangers. I just said about the contamination and uh, not to go out there today. So he said it was better out over there, but uh, I'm not really getting sick. I don't want a chance. It's a the water contact closure is from Loring Street all the way south past Crystal Pier to Hornblend Street. It starts just south of the famous Tourmaline Beach surf spot. Almost all of the surfers decided to heed the warning and not risk it. I don't know. I don't want to take the chance to get sick, you know, ruin my weekend. The closure and warnings will remain until sampling and field observations are done and it's safe to go back in the ocean along that stretch of coast. And while the people we saw chose to get out of the water when they found out about the sewage contamination, the wildlife that lives here has no choice. In Pacific Beach, this is Anna Laurel for CBS 8.